Welcome to K1 World Grand Prix 2014 Japan. This is the under 65 kilogram World Championship tournament here at the Yogi National Stadium, second dimension in Tokyo. I'm Russell Goodall. And Nicholas Pettis. This is a K1 uh, under 70 kilogram fight between uh, Yuya Yamamoto versus uh, Kareth Bella from England. Uh, Yamamoto is, uh, was about third place in the uh, K1 Max, in the former organization there against um, Bella from England. We don't have a lot of information uh, about him except for he's uh, in Japan. He's known as the British Dragon, and maybe that's what the tattoo is on his chest. Let's see what happens in this under 70 kg fight. Hmm, this is going to be interesting. <clears throat> they both look really pumped up and fired mm. to go here. In the pre-footage uh, of the fight, we had some of this uh, fight footage from England, actually. Yeah. Where he knocked out a couple of guys, so we know he's got that kind of power. Mouse. Yes. And you can see there's a clear height difference here between the two fighters. Mm. But since we actually don't have the data on mm. our British Dragon here, we're just going to have to eyeball it. Yeah. You know, to slightly... Let's see if we can, um, bam! Oh, okay. great combo. Nice punches there from, uh, Bella. Yes. Oh, yeah. Oi, there you go. Yeah, that's better. Nice. Okay, so we clearly have a Dutch kickboxing style fight uh -huh. here. With that good old left hook, right low kick thing. Chop, chop it away at Yuya Yamamoto. Nice, he actually kicks yeah. hard, huh? Yeah. Way. yeah. See, uh, here at this stage, um, Yamamoto is probably the only person, the fighter in this uh, in this new uh, uh, K1 who's had experience from the, in the former K1 stage. Yeah, so that Come might in. be a little bit tricky for people mm. watching this if they don't understand it. Mm. They want to change the direction a couple of times during the years. Yes. And uh, this is the time, the first tournament where they actually restructured the K1 yeah. and started um, more weight classes mm. compared to the old days, uh, the beginning days when it was just like um, under 70 kilos or heavyweights. Mm. Oh, great punch there. Hey, look at that. That actually hurt him. So I think for the athletes, it's a uh, it's a fantastic progression for a um, um, yeah uh, for the new weight classes and heavy yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. For, you know because it's, it gives uh, fighters a bigger variety and not everyone's you know built to be whatever classes they had before. Ooh, dangerous kick there! Nice. He's been dropping that all day. Man, those hands look heavy. Nice. That was a good first round. They, they were very clear on their strategies. They stuck to their plan. It's just a, a clean, good fight. Let's say it's a 10 10 to them uh, because they kind of did about the same amount. And had about the same amount of, of hits and punches. Sure. But I like the uh, the British Dragons low kicks. Man, that left hook low kick is great. That was actually a dangerous shot. I'm glad that they showed us in the replay. It's just the face of an experienced fighter, you know. Yuya Yamoto has a fight record of 35 wins with 12 by knockout. And actually 26 losses and one draw. So that's like combined almost 70 fights. Yeah. Oh, yeah, almost 70 or 60 fights. 60 fights, yeah, at age 30, yeah. Second Well, he's smarty and he's been enjoying the situation here as it comes into a round two with Gareth Bell. Yeah. 
I like the British Dragons uh, fighting mm. style. It's very compact and, and very like straight to the point. You know, it's got great left hook both to the body, like you saw here twice, and also to the head. His defense is just really tight. Oh, look at that! Great counter kick again. Nice. We got that boxing on the inside. Oh, yeah. Man, he's taking a lot of shots on the chin, dude. Yep. Yes! And he just keeps walking forward. <laughs> One of them is called him Bella. Bella, yeah. So let's go with that. Bella. Back to work. We keep being bringing up prior to the ring like his pants say. He's smooth. He's evaded a couple of those kicks like that. Oh. Great shots. There you go. What a beautiful combination. Oi. Oh, Bella's got great defense. Nice. Look at those punches. It seems like just because of the way he's moving the gear, Yamamoto is more busy somehow, but he's actually not connecting with anything. Like that tight defense of Bella is awesome. Nice. I've got to give it to him though, Yuya really is putting a lot of pressure yeah. on him. But you know what, it, instead of that being a, an advantage for Yuya, it seems uh -huh. like he's just putting himself in the right the position for Bella to actually, right. you know, do his combination. Yeah, unfortunately for Yamamoto, I guess, yeah. Nice, look at that, he really smacked him a couple times like that. His face is starting to swell up, he's taking a lot of punishment. Oh man, those low kicks. Done in the first round. Uh, second round. Yeah, yeah probably, uh, like you said, uh, I mean, he still seems relaxed enough, but not as, not as much as after the first round. Oh man, look yeah. at his face. It's it's really been banged up in yeah. this round. I actually understand what he says. <laughs> Keep it compact, yes. yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Which he has. He yeah. has kept it super tight for the, these the last mm. two rounds. I really like his fighting style, actually. Mm. Great combination. She also can do the high kicks and stuff, yeah. but he hides it a lot. Um, he threw one really good one that almost connected. So they're there when he wants to. Yeah, I would like to see like a body shot high kick or something, mm. you know? Like a left body hook and then just go straight into the high kick. You never know. He has shown a lot of, he has thrown a lot of uh, left hooks, though. left hooks to the body also. So it's gone all around. Oi, that shot connected. Nice. Super smooth. See, that's that left body shot I was talking about. Nice. He's got that uppercut in the inbox in there. Nice. Oh, man, he's taking a beating. What's he smiling at? <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's the hard one to understand, yeah. <laughs> 
He is tough as nails, though. He is taking so many shots and just keeps coming forward. Oh. Oh. Mixing it up, <laughs> body shot, uppercuts, hooks, everything. It's like going to town. See, mm. you almost had a great high kick there. Oh, more shot mm. connecting. Mm. Yeah, it just mm. could be a game changer if you connect it. Oh, nice one. Ooh. Nobody says, Oh my god, there's a minute left for this. <laughs> yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. It's, it's on, that was a good old sneaky fish pick kick with the heel there. <laughs> Ooh. Three. Shot there for you. 30 seconds, huh? Here we go. Let's see what he can pull out. Wow. Oh, man. It is a slugfest here. Look at that. More combinations than a McDonald's menu. <laughs> oh, there you go. That was close, and the ropes weren't there. Maybe. <laughs> no, I think Maybe. he's okay. I clearly give this fight to the British dragon, Bella. Bella. Yeah. Here we go home. Yes. But man, he never gassed out. He never ran out of stamina, mm -hmm. and True. just kept going for it. Yeah. He just took too much damage. Yeah, well, the right. Yeah, and, yeah. and not, not enough connections, you reckon? No, uh -huh. I don't think so. But we'll see what the judges score it as. Yeah. I'll be very surprised if it goes not to Bella. I actually wouldn't mind watching a draw because then we get to see another three minutes. There you go. Bella. One for Bella. I think you can put your hand down now, sir. What? Okay. 29, 29. Hey, yeah. Split decision. So the British dragon takes it home. Interesting fight to watch. Yeah, super exciting. Really, uh, a technically high-level fight. Mm -hmm. um, I was very impressed with um, with Bella. Stomach, mm. with it, that is namesake, and a big fight it is. Uh, oh, just a little, another exchange to the work <laughs> that uh, Yamamoto did. Yeah, sign of respect for his incredible fighting spirit. Bro. Yep, and into the bell there is with his uh, his uh, Yamamoto going back and bell up with his trophy. <laughs> well done on your first fight in K1. Yeah, and Some of those, yeah, like some of those cable uh, knockouts we saw. Would be nice to see more of those knockouts like that. Well, after this, we have the final of Gyo and Soda of the minus 64 kilo world championships. 
that's going to be good. <laughs> I'm looking forward to that one. Yeah. yeah. Thank you for watching. This was the Cable World Cup from Japan. Championship Tournament. I'm Russell Goodall. And Nicholas Pettis.